What's up guys, my name is Morgan Christer. Today I'm going to be showing you how to get this makeup which is not good, but it's good enough for me. I usually do this every day without the eyeshadow, but I thought why not throw in some eyeshadow there. So yeah, I hope you enjoy this video. I cannot do makeup to save me, so... These are all affordable as well because I can't afford anything. But um, yeah, if you like this, then keep on watching. I'm taking Avon Men's Moisturizer and rubbing it all over my face. Now I'm going to pop my hair up. So, uh, oi, hello. There we go. Oh, and I don't have a hair tie. Now I have a hair tie, I'm just taking my hair off my face. Now it's out, let's do my makeup. I'm using this Revolution Oil Fix Spray because I am oily. I'm taking Urban Decay Naked Foundation in the shade 1.5. I'm just putting that all over my face. I'm taking the Maybelline Age Rewind um, Concealer in the shade Light because I am pale AF. Does anybody even say that? Anybody? AF? Oh well. I'm just blending that in with my dirty sponge and I know it's dirty but I'll clean it later, I promise. I'm just taking some MAC powder and putting that under my eyes to set it. <coughs> I'm now going to take Urban Decay Brow Beater and I'm just brushing through my brows first and then I'm going to outline them. Then I realised, oh, that's a little too dark. But all I do is outline them and then lightly brush the product through the brows just to make it a little bit darker. So I don't really do anything, I don't change the shape. Just want to make it a bit fuller than it normally is. I'm now taking the 17 Define and Concord Contour, I think it was, bronzer because I need to have a tan because it's summertime and I don't have one so I'm going to make one. Now I don't know why I'm putting it on my forehead, I don't really know what it does, I'm just copying everyone that does it because I don't know what I'm doing. I'm now just putting that to define the contour. I'm going to take this Body Shop blush in the shade Coral, I think. I'm not really sure what it's called. I'm popping up on my cheeks. I'm going to brush away any of the powder that I have left on my face. And I'm taking the highlight part of that, which I think is also called Coral as well. But I could be wrong. Damn B highlighter blinding. <laughs> Just kidding. Now I'm taking this MAC eyeshadow palette and I'm just using the two browns. Then I realised my eyeshadow brush still had red eyeshadow on it from the other day. So now it's a mix between brown and Red, but now I'm just taking the contour colour and just putting it over my lid. I'm also putting it under my eyes, and I don't know why, I just think it makes my eyes pop a bit more. And I'm using this 
gold color from the MAC palette but then I realized it doesn't have any pigment but I may as well just put another eye because I've already built more of them. I'm now just using this color out of a Morphe palette. Um, I'm not really sure which color it is. And I'm now taking the color Orb, I think it's called, in my inner corners. I'm now taking this Maybelline mascara called Sensational, and it really is sensational, like it's the best thing that's ever happened. My favourite makeup product that I have in my makeup bag. I'm taking that on the bottom lashes because I like my bottom lashes long. Oh! Oh! I'm just going to do the same on the other eye because I don't want just one full lash and then none. And I'm also putting it on the bottom lash as well. I'm not taking this Stay Pout or All About That Pout um, lipstick and I'm just putting it on my lips. It's a nice pink colour but it doesn't actually have a shade. And that is it. Oh. Oh, there's my boys. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. Thank you guys for watching. Please make sure to like and subscribe and comment any video ideas or message me them. Here's all my social medias. That's it. So, thank you for watching. Good. Bye.